Shelley and we designed this property. Come and take a tour. <laughs> a client was wanting a tropical home but with modern and contemporary finishes. She's youthful and likes to play so she wanted the property still to feel like it could have fun but also be in the sophisticated market. This is our gorgeous sunken lounge. It was designed by the architect. We made these custom um, cement tiles in the matte black and cream. We cast set the mold so they're um, unique to Azula. So when we got this property it was the bare bones. We only had the flooring even the roof wasn't finished or the ceiling. So we added in a rustic jati beam to make it feel more earthy and warm. We did a vintage cement finish paint and we were really excited to um, create these lights. We wanted an oversized rattan light to play on the scale of this room to make it feel large but also tropical and playful. I'd love to show you around the dining room. It's got some really unique features. We installed the rustic Palimanan stone. It's done in a traditional stone masonry method. So instead of cutting the stone like what is usually done, we actually chip it away to make it feel far more organic. So I'd love to show you around the kitchen and show you some of our details. We custom designed these chairs. We wanted it to have a really large amount of volume in the upholstery for it to be comfortable. We added in this corrugated iron detail at the bottom so that it's actually practical to clean. Um, it was our plan to bring in large oversized symmetrical lights because we felt that um, in a kitchen that was so modern that we wanted to ground it with some earth and nature. So this room was inspired by a, a hacienda. We wanted to bring in the archways and um, textured concrete. So the way that we built this was bringing in Gibson panel lines and then adding a layer of depth. Let's make this love last till Valentine's So in the staircase we really wanted to play with scale. We've got these amazing ceiling heights and these beautiful architectural details that we were lucky enough to inherit in the building. So we added in these large light fixtures and then textured art, oversized um, antique pieces to create dynamics. And we are lost inside our love so this is my absolute favorite room in the house. Need us, what if we'd stay like this? The bedroom's done with this arch bed head. We just wanted to play again on scale with the round lights, the round bed head, having a, a real twist between traditional and modern. We're super excited to show you this wild bathroom. It's got a lot of details and it's a real uh, showcase of how to bring complex details into a fun and creative space. Uh, so when we inherited this building there was nothing in this room and we were really um, creatively challenged what to put in here and what sort of bathtub and it just didn't feel like the right move to bring in something traditional or so we custom made this round bath we brought it in with a green terrazzo and a black hand mosaic lining when we came on board and the contractor was finishing they just complete this amazing sauna it's done out of a traditional pine wood so we were inspired just to bring in the the palimanan stone in the rustic finish again we also had the opportunity to bring in a little bit more of a lounge area. We wanted to be respectful to what the contractor had, do had done with the original bones so we just took inspiration, brought in this piping line. So when we received the brief for Azula, uh, our client wanted to create a space that had a balanced lifestyle that both enjoyed partying and yoga. So when we came up to the rooftop, we felt like this was the perfect tranquil space for creating not only a lounge, but also a yo yoga shala. Thank you so much for checking out our latest project, Azula House. We can't wait to see you again soon.